Just begin by breathing in and then breathing out. Letting the mind soften and the body ease. Breathing in, breathing out. I'm not trying to control or force the breath, but instead noticing how it falls into and out of the body. Breathing in, breathing out. Surrendering to the natural flow of your breath. Breathing in. Breathing out. Noticing that natural flow of breath. Natural ease of breath. Surrendering to the rhythm. Surrendering to the natural deepening of your breath. As you lie still, the body naturally relaxes and lets go. As you breathe in and breathe out, your body relaxes and you're able to let go, breathing in, breathing out. As you breathe, if you notice there's any tension remaining in the body, just invite those parts of the body to relax and let go. Breathing in, breathing out. Similarly with the mind, if there is tension in the mind, see if as you breathe, you can allow the tension to drift away, just like the clouds drift through the sky. Breathing in, breathing out. Breathing in, breathing out and letting your mind journey now. Imagining yourself in a busy city street. You see all the shops and businesses, crowds of people hurrying to and from one place or another, the traffic on the road crawling through the city, bumper to bumper. Just ahead on the sidewalk you notice a doorway between two buildings, a small opening a cosy retreat from the hustle and bustle of the world. You slip easily through the crowd toward the doorway. Arriving there, you step across the narrow entrance into a dimly lit, warm and inviting space that shelters you from the outside world. And you walk deeper into the entrance 
and arrive at the top of a flight of 10 stairs. You begin to make your way down the stairs and as you do, the sound of the city is further and further away. Every step you take, you are moving further and further away from the noise of the world into a place of quiet, descending, sinking deeper and deeper down the steps, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You are now at the bottom of the staircase, calm and relaxed. You can't even hear the noise of the city above you now. All of that busyness is so far away. And before you is a tall wooden door. There is no handle or lever with which to open it. You look at the door with curiosity. And upon the door is the word, release carved into the wood delicately and you contemplate and feel the essence of the word release and as your body releases physically the door opens letting go as it unlocks and the old hinges slowly open and reveal a small round room a library, bookshelves from ceiling to floor. And as you step inside, the door closes behind you. The room is a private place, inviting, secluded. There are no windows. It is silent inside. You are content and secure here. In the middle of the room is a small wooden desk. And on the desk, there is a large old book covered in dust. You pick up the book and feel the weight of it in your hand. And you sense wonder as you behold the grand old book. It has been in this place for a long time, waiting for you before you even existed. But when you open the pages, they're all blank. This is the book of freedom. It has within it the power to free you from anything in your life that is bothering you, weighing you down, preventing you from moving forward. It's time for you to write in the book you dip a quill in some ink and easily you allow the words to flow onto the pages of any situations that are blocking you, events that frighten you, any conflict you're experiencing or negative feelings you're holding on to. Write about anything and everything holding you back, burdening you. There is no right or wrong Feel and imagine that your thoughts are imprinted in the book. Allow images from your mind to form and feelings to flow, letting them spill out like magic into the pages of the book. The book fills with all of your worldly concerns, absorbing them, words, pictures, and the more you feel the book, the lighter your body feels. You are heard, understood, reassured and relieved. And as the last writings are inscribed in the book, you close it. And the roof above you opens and slowly but surely it reveals a clear blue sky above. 
you look up at the sky and you raise your forearms and hands, your palms facing away from you. And as you do, the body begins to float, lifting you free from the floor. You are floating and you realize you have the freedom to fly anywhere you choose. You float higher when your arms are raised and you lower when your arms are down. You begin to float toward the roof, gliding up and out of the room into the sky. You feel a freedom as you fly higher and higher in the sky. You see the world below you becoming smaller and smaller. You have left your worldly concerns behind as you float toward the heavens higher and higher. And the higher you go, the more joy and freedom fills your energy body. Everything is behind you now. You can see the earth, a blue sphere, floating in the vast emptiness of space. You are drifting through space and time itself. The beauty of the stars and planets. Serenity and peace. You are relaxed, slipping into this state of deep stillness. You are a million miles away, yet you feel connected to the entire universe. Vast, weightless, timeless. And as you float within the universal spaciousness, you can hear a voice echoing in your mind. I am without beginning or ending. I am eternal. I am free to experience life in any way I choose. My consciousness is not bound by time or space. Like the universe itself, I am limitless, part of the vast unified wholeness, free of the past free of the future. My life is in perfect order, unfolding according to the perfect universal plan. I do not strive, I simply allow. I release my grip on life. I am calm. Everything I need is taken care of. I am open to life and all of its experiences. I am at peace. I release judgment. I welcome all and accept all. I do not resist my problems. I observe them. My mind is open and I accept that all my problems will resolve in time. I have all the time in the world. In the quiet between my thoughts, inspiration rises, all is clear. Life transforms in expected and unexpected ways. Obstacles that once seemed insurpassable are now insignificant. You rise above all challenges to a place of serenity. The path is clear. Every day in every way, my life becomes more and more harmonious. I trust, I release resistance and yearning. I am grateful and receive. My consciousness is not bound. Like the universe itself, I am limitless. I am part of the vast, unidentified wholeness. Spend as long as you need, floating effortlessly, drifting, being, breathing. And when you're ready to, just imagine yourself floating back down to your body and bring attention to the soles of the feet, imagining roots growing into the earth. Just knowing that that peace and that knowledge that you've experienced 
is with you always. Only gently waking the body when it feels like you're fully grounded into the here and the now. Perhaps moving fingers and toes. And gently stretching the hands above the body, either above the head or to the side. Just moving in ways that feel good for you. 